Safari Central's team is an absolutely great team. They are a great team. So I think now we can say we're a pretty good team as well. So pretty, pretty happy about everything. And uh, it's just surreal. It's absolutely surreal. I had a real good attitude about whether we win or lose, what's going to happen. And I'm just like, you know what? We're going to stay the course. And um, we're not going to get too up, too down. And uh, but now, uh, now I'm pretty, pretty jacked up. <laughs> All right. Coach, there's a lot of emotion from a lot of the kids from you right now. Yeah. How much does this mean to your community? Oh man, I, you know, we've had some, you know, some uh, wrestling has always been real successful with uh, winning team championships, and uh, baseball has won a couple team, one team championship. Uh, so, so we, you know, we've had some success. We've had some team championships, but, um, but you know, getting over the hump in any sport. Uh, what it's, it's just a it's a huge a huge accomplishment and just so it's so proud and so just loss of words for for, for what these kids have done and the amount of work they've put in over the last however many years in 2015 though those guys that those seniors that year that gave us a chance to have an opportunity here against Osceola you know I owe those guys a huge amount of credit because they kept this 27 seniors going to have a dream to get down here and, and, and see what they can do and see if they can get a gold ball. And, you know, uh, it's, it's, it's an amazing, amazing uh, journey that we've had this year. And to end up here was just icing on the cake. And now to find a way to come away with a game ball or a, a gold ball in overtime of all things against the defending state champions of Division Four. I mean, it's, it's like a storybook. It's just absolutely amazing.